We're flying through the cold sky. It's a beautiful morning over here. But what's even more beautiful is all the new leaks we have for you guys today. It's going to be crazy. If you guys are ready and hyped, hit the like button down below, guys, as well. I know that over 40% of people watching this video right now is not subscribed. So go ahead and press the sub button down below. That will be absolutely appreciated. If you want to see more videos, be sure to hit subscribe and ding dong the notification bell for more videos every single day. If you've done that, go comment down below, hashtag Pink Army. Let's get this going and enjoy the video. Hey, guys, what's going on? Small Blaze here. Welcome back to another video. Yes, they're back in roblox anime flying simulator for another video and today guys we're finally allowed to leak some absolutely crazy stuff for anime flying simulator that's gonna be coming really really soon i'm super excited hope you guys are as well of course if you are, are like i said smash the like button down below guys that will be insane before we get started of course we have to give away our daily chikara so we're gonna go again and gift ourselves 40k to let's just go ahead and go choose dark easy 3 i don't know why i like the name there we go of course if you guys don't know what i do i normally in a uh, video if you're in my server I give away a random 40k card to a random person so always be sure to join me if I'm in anime fighting simulator that will be probably the easiest way to get some free Chikara okay quickly went over to a private server because we have a lot to talk about today because we got ourselves some leaks which are directly from of course the, the developers of the game so they are confirmed but before we continue with today's video I want to talk about today's sponsor G2A G2A is a website where you can find literally games game accessories custom products and a lot of different things cheaper than you could normally buy in the world for example if you want to buy the newest game fall guys which is the hottest game right now instead of for 20 euros you can get it on g2a for 1781 as well of course robux gift cards that kind of stuff they all have them on g2a as well so go check out g2a description down below if you guys want to get yourself these deals right away and we were finally allowed to share them today. First off, I want to address the big elephant in the room. The big elephant, which of course, if we go over here, we have a gigantic portal in the overworld. And this, of course, means something. It means something. What is it says to do with it? Is it going to be a new dimension? Is it going to be something new? added to the game for their new game because of course if you guys have not seen my latest video they are making anime legends a new game as well on roblox but no it's not that so of course i'll be sharing you guys in just a second what it is it's gonna be but first off, we have ourselves the biggest announcement, and that is the first quarter of 2021 of Anime Fighting Simulator, what their roadmap is. If you guys don't know what a roadmap is, it's literally something that the admins have. So they have a guideline what they have to work on on the first quarter of the year. So that's going to be from January 1st to March 32nd. So let's go to the 31st, sorry, not 32nd, because that, that of course doesn't exist. 31st. Um, so let's go check that out first, and then we're going to talk about this portal right here. So, here it is. Here it is. So, Anime Fight Simulator 2021 First Quarter Roadmap. So, right now, of course, we have this. Then we have Anime Fight Simulator V2 Season 3, which is absolutely pretty, pretty crazy. Because there's going to be some big changes, of course, to Anime Fight Simulator. There's not going to be the revamp pool out there, but that's a little bit, of course, sad. But we got ourselves some really cool updates coming in the first quarter so uh we got ourselves dimension 5 coming in which is absolutely crazy because a lot of people have been asking for dimension 5 so we're getting a new dimension added to the game 100 percent confirmed which could be pretty cool we're gonna get ourselves of course the new season 3 battle pass which is gonna be pretty sick as well we're gonna get ourselves a new ui update i would hope and i hope they listen to our because like we can we are allowed to give suggestions as well i hope we're gonna get ourselves a full new ui because right now i think the ui absolutely sucks that's maybe just only my opinion but i think like it's really hard to find some things in the game like i think it's just stupid that all the stuff is like just scattered around like it's just it's just it's just so weird how stuff is labeled like for example like the inventory of your fighting pass why is it over here with animations why isn't there just like a nice menu over here with fighting pass or animations as a whole and as well that it's so close you know, like, maybe just have a pop-up in the middle. Because I forget it so so many times that it's just open on the side. It just takes up screen space. You know, like, there's a lot of stuff that could be better. Like, you know, why is Walk Street Jump Speed really in the settings menu? That kind of stuff, you know? Like, or why is there a bus results 
button. Like, it, it's just kind of weird, some stuff in the UI that it just doesn't make sense. And then there's a button here for settings, and then there's another button here for settings uh, for the VIP. So, like, why is this button not just in here? You know, it, like, there's a lot of stuff that's just kind of, kind of interesting. Of course, it's very, very nice. Um, to have a VIP panel, but you know, you get whatever. So that is, of course, the thing that's gonna be changed. And then the last thing is gonna be map updates. So I don't know what they really mean with this. Probably they mean with this just that we're gonna get ourselves new training locations, like we got ourselves the last update. We got ourselves three new training locations. If you guys didn't know, in Dimension Four, that's pretty cool. And then as well, still in the second, the first quarter. So not even in the second quarter, we got ourselves weekly content updates and patches. By weekly, they probably mean like every two, maybe three three weeks uh but we like you have to think that all of this stuff is going to be coming in around you know the january 1st to march 31st which is absolutely crazy that's going to be insane we're going to probably start off dimension 5 really early we're going to get this new battle pass but this is like the big main things that are going to be coming but that doesn't cover this portal right you know because I was like, this portal has to do something. It's going to go somewhere. Does it have to do with the new game? Is it Dimension 5? And I asked the owner, okay, I don't know if you guys can give any spoilers, but is this portal for Dimension 5? And I will quote what his response was. And the response is, the portal is not for Dimension 5. So that is confirmed. As well, the thing that I thought that maybe it's going to be the portal for the new game, Anime Legends. That's not true either. Because I was like, oh, you know what could be cool is that we're going to get this as a mini portal once uh, Anime Legends is almost coming out. And if you go through it, through Anime Fighting Simulator, you get yourself a little extra reward or a little bit of a unique cosmetic. So people know that you came from Anime Fighting Simulator and it gives you an incentive to check out the game as well, which will be really, really cool. So they said they liked it at the end, but that of course is then not the idea either, because if they like my idea, that's not the idea. So this is something probably, like, I am almost certain, because we only, like, on the roadmap, we can see Dimension 5. They confirmed it's not that. They as well said this new battle pass. The, why would they build a portal? And we as well seen the teaser image of a big, uh, gigantic ice area. Like, why would that be for just a battle pass? Like, they've just chucked it in here the last time as well, you know? It's not going to be that. So I am pretty certain because uh, like there's going to be dungeons in Anime Legends as well. I'm pretty sure that this is going to be dungeons or something amongst the line of that. Or maybe some big tournament stuff. But this is going to be crazy. I'm pretty sure this portal is going to be super duper wild. And I cannot wait for what's going to happen with this. They didn't say anything about this furthermore, which is a little bit sad. I really would have loved to know what's going to be behind this portal. But we probably just have to wait until it's actually released three two and one as well for the uh, anime fighting simulator v2 update that was given on the roadmap of course again you can see it right now on the screen they are planning to do this in one update but maybe it will be two updates i would love if they spread it out for youtube wise i know that a lot of people would love just one update probably but i would love two updates just because then people have something to look forward to because you know if we get the mansion 5 plus the ui updates that'll be pretty cool and if we get a battle pass plus map updates that'll be two cool updates i would personally recommend if they would spread it out but their goal is to try to make it into one update uh that they just said because like i'm just reading through all the information that we're allowed to give and that's one of the things as well so probably it's going to be one update if they can manage it but otherwise it will probably be split into two i hope they're not going to cram dimension 5 plus the battle pass i would love if they would just do dimension 5 and ui updates and battle pass and map updates because otherwise ui and map updates is not like the biggest you know most interesting thing so if they would combine it together that would be really really cool the last thing i quickly want to share is just i'm just going to be quoting a full message as well there will be a screenshot right now on the screen with all the text as well okay so here's the message this is recording of course anime uh, legends and of course why the revamp didn't go through for anime fine simulator so the revamp was supposed to be something big for anime fine simulator but what we were making was too different from the game and we decided to create a whole new game this is how anime legends was born our anime legends will be an rpg we wanted to have dungeons with a story and quests like never been seen before on roblox but we never intended 
to leave Anime Fighting Simulator. We kept doing some small updates. Now that Anime uh, Legends teaser was released, people have been asking for some updates about Anime Fighting Simulator. More information. What will happen to Anime Fighting Simulator? Like we said, we keep Anime Fighting Simulator better with development going, but more uh, than we listen to the community and we like to still do some rework and some aspect of the game, just like UI and map changes. And we're proud to show you our 2021 first quarter roadmap for Anime Fighting Simulator. That, of course, was the roadmap that we just saw on the screen before so it's a lot of info guys there's a lot of things but what we now know as well for anime legends is that we're gonna it will be an rpg there will be dungeons there will be a story and there will be quests inside of course more we don't really know they're as well working more on anime fighting simulator than they work on anime legends they don't have like an exact release time or whatever for that game of course that's pretty pretty nice because i think a lot of people of course right now are more excited about anime fighting simulator just because it's their big game a lot of people are playing it of course anime legends could get bigger than anime fighting simulator but we would have to see the game first and see how it plays and grow its player base etc etc there you have it guys those are right now the new teasers the big stuff that's going to be coming to anime fighting simulator that has been confirmed by the admins and the owners of anime fighting simulator it's gonna be super excited what are you guys most excited for i think you know dimension 5 is cool battle pass is cool but i'm still most excited to see what's behind this bloody portal i really want to see what's behind this it's gonna be really cool i hope it's dungeons I don't know why, I just hope it's dungeons. It's going to be really cool to see what's going to be happening with this thing right here. I just am so in love with this portal. So let me know, guys, in the comment section down below what you guys think as well. Thank you so much for sticking all the way to the end with all the information. I know this is not, you know, uh, a, a really visual video or whatever it is. But I think all this information is very important to bring out to you guys the faces. And know that it's right now going to be coming to Anime Fighting Simulator 100%. So if you guys are excited for the future update, of course, smash the like button down below. Guys, subscribe if you're new. If you guys don't want to miss anything, Anime Fighting Simulator, Shino Life, or Bubblegum Simulator. And I'll see you guys later today or tomorrow for another video. So I'll see you guys. Take care. Love you. Bye. Thanks so much for watching. And of course, as well, take care.